Phil Curlin, constitutional law. He was just as smart as could be, and we just connected. Uh, Professor Strauss, he took seriously what we had to say as students and made us feel like we had a contribution to make. Uh, Jeff Stone, because I thought he uh, asked the most pointed questions and kept everyone engaged during the class. Certainly, I recall enjoying uh, Professor Calvin a great deal. Uh, and, uh, and I recall uh, the contracts professor, Malcolm Sharp. Got to be Richard Epstein, um, because you never knew what would happen. Uh, my, my favorite professors were probably uh, Harry, Harry Calvin, who taught torts, uh, Phil Curlin, who taught con law, uh, Bernie Meltzer, and finally Walter Blum, who was probably the best classroom teacher I've ever had in my life. Eclectic, extraordinarily bright, and good people. Good study mates. Driven. Intense. Ideologically intense. Smart. Bright. Bright. Brilliant. Smart as hell. Good friend. Loyal. Quirky. Energetic. Interesting. 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 And nerdy. And with great senses of humor. I can't think of just one. <laughs> uh, it's hard to pick one. There were a number of them. Uh, Soya Menshikov being asked to uh, <clears throat> elaborate on some point. Mm, yes. Elements of Soya Menshikov probably after taking my first exam, not knowing whether I had done exactly what they wanted or nothing like they wanted. <laughs> the most terrifying moment was when you watched a professor begin to mouth your last name. So when someone said, Mr. Greenberg. Uh, wine mess. Probably wine mess. Uh, uh, something called wine mess. Probably that everybody else is just as scared as you are. Oh, these are deep questions. I appreciate that this is going to mean so much to you down the road that you don't appreciate right now. It would probably be to have taken uh, every one of Walter Blum's classes instead of just all but one of them. Probably it would be to relax and everything will work out pretty well after all. <laughs> the truth is, uh, actually, this is gonna, may sound strange, but take criminal procedure. As a lawyer, people expect you to know that and they wanna talk to you about it and it's really helpful if you're able to talk about it even if you don't practice that. I would go back and tell my 1L self to really nurture relationships with professors and um, to soak all of that up and everything they have to offer when you're here. It's such a gift to be in an environment where you're so intellectually alive 